Hi guys, back with another video for my troll, uh, Druid, and uh, so I'm going to continue questing. And I'm not really exactly sure where I'm going to quest, but uh, now let's do that Ride to Orgrimmar quest, because that'll give me a little bit of XP. Hopefully it'll level me up to 11, and at level 1 I get uh, for nothing. <laughs> That's great. Okay, anyways, um, <coughs> I'm going to go to Orgrimmar, and I will see you guys there. Be back. Actually, I thought that you guys uh might like seeing this, seeing uh, the road to Orgamar, seeing what it looks like and all that. You just kind of take this little path over here, and a little bit more road, and Orgamar will be just up ahead. Here are some cool little siege thing, siege machines that are pretty badass looking, and here is Orgamar. The new Orgmar since like Cataclysm or whatever. The redesign is actually fairly nice. I kind of like it. Okay, and there we go. Now I'm gonna go in cat form, and I need to go over here. And thankfully, in cat form, you get your uh, damage, your fall damage redu reduced, so, that actually might have killed me if I was not in cat form, which sucks. <laughs> but you can always take the elevator, I will have to take that on my way up. But you do get an achievement from jumping from there. And uh, now we have to go back to uh, the flight master person and uh, turn that shit in and then head back to uh, Razor Hill for more XP and questing and stuff. And when I hit 15, I'm going to uh, respec to... Uh, What's it called? Uh, restoration, I think. Is that? Yeah, restoration. Hopefully, I have enough money to do that. I'm not really sure how much it costs. So, yeah. Elevator jump on the elevator floor. You have to actually jump when it comes down, or else it'll just go right through you. And you won't actually be on the elevator. Okay. And there we are. And here is the flat master. Cool little wyverns sitting on their little peaks, taking a nap or whatever. Unfortunately, his nap duty is off, and now he has to take me on a trip back to Razor Hill. Let's go. We. And uh, yeah, it's just kind of the same thing. So I guess I will pause this part. Okay, I'm back. So let's go turn this in. Uh, I might as well just go to the cat form, so I can get there a little bit faster. And here we go. This soul will probably level me up. All right. Please. <laughs> Please. Awesomeness. Okay. Level 11. Get a little bit more stats, but unfortunately no spells. That will come next level. So, I am uh, kind of lost at this point. I don't really know where to go. Um, well, I mean, there are two options. I can either go do this quest, or I can go turn this quest in and start a huge chain of quests over here, and I think I'll go do that. And I might as well just show you guys the video, the walk. Kind of cool looking. I am no longer in Razor Hill. I need to give Cargo Beskar at the Baron's Outpost my recruitment letter. And that will actually start up a whole chain of quests over there. Hopefully I'll get some greens, uh, some 
green items. And uh, I will definitely get to level 12 from there. And then I will go into a new quest chain, which I might get to level 15. I've been doing that whole thing. I don't know. It's, it's likely that I will get to 15 around there. And I'm being attacked. Great. You know, I could just run, but I would be missing out on experience. You know, I'm just gonna, just to make this video uh, more efficient, I guess. More entertaining. I'm going to uh, skip this part, so. Be back in a few. Okay, I am back, and uh, I got a lot of herbs and ore on the way, so we've got some bonus XP from that. Very nice. And I, uh, when I get to level 15, I'm probably just going to go over to Orgamar and stay in Orgamar. And, uh, like, in between dungeons, I can go in and uh, pick herbs and get that up so I can sell them on the auction house and get some decent money. So let's uh let's go kill some shit. Fortunately, this is a very high populated server, so there are gonna be a lot of people here. Yeah, I'm definitely lagging up, so I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. And I got disconnected from the server and I died. So um, I guess this would be kind of a good point to show you guys how death works in World of Warcraft. So pretty much uh, when you get your health to uh, zero, you die. There is no like last chance kind of thing in Guild Wars. You just you just die. So when you die, you get resurrected uh, from a spirit healer, and uh, from there you can either uh, uh, talk to the spirit healer and get uh, resurrected for her and get uh, get just put here and be alive again. Unfortunately, if you do it this way, uh, your armor durability will greatly decrease, and uh, also you'll get uh, a debuff called the resurrection sickness, which will make you a lot worse. It won't like make you level level. It will like Decrease your strength, your agility, your intellect, and your stamina, and all that stuff by like 25% or whatever. And you don't want to do that <laughs> unless you're really desperate and you don't know how to get back your corpse. It's, resurrection sickness only lasts like 10 or 20 or whatever minutes, so it's not that long of a debuff. But, anyways, I'm not going to do that because uh, I don't want that debuff. <laughs> anyways. My corpse is actually just over here, so it won't take that long to get over there. And then when you get your curse, you get your corpse, you get like a little pop-up that says re resurrect now. And you click on that to resurrect yourself. So, uh, it'll give me that, uh, little box in a second here. Any second now. <laughs> I think that's me. Yep. Resurrect now, yes. Don't really know what killed me or who killed me, but uh, doesn't really matter. I don't think I lost any durability because um, I'm not really high enough level. They gave newbies a little bit of a break from dying. If you die at a low level, uh, you don't lose any durability, which is a kind of a noob friendly friendly kind of thing. So. I like it. <laughs> I don't like having to spend money on durability when I barely have any money at all already, so. <sighs> this is one of the reasons why I don't like playing on the high pop server. So many low level so many low level players. Very, very few mobs, so this is going to be kind of a and of course that that guy has that one because he's in cat form. There's a lot of competition 
which makes it very annoying. Oh my god, <laughs> I can't find anything. There's probably some over here. There has to be something. Yeah, all of them are dead. <laughs> Unfortunately, these things drop beaks, so it's not like you just kill seven of them, then you're done. You have to get seven beaks, and they don't always drop beaks. Let's just hope this one drops a beak. And he runs away. That's great, too. And yes, we got a beak. Nice. Okay, six more. Hopefully, I only need to kill six more. Beak. Beak, beak. Please. No. Fuck. Okay, this is going to take longer than I thought. Just gonna like, grab this thing before he does. Sorry, bro. No. Yeah, actually be distracted, because I want to go grab that one. I'm gonna... No, he, he sees it. Does he attack? Yes, he does. What a jerk. Okay. No. Another quest over here I'm gonna grab. Okay, uh, I will definitely use those. Those are very good. Okay, so I need to kill uh, these Razor Main Hunters as well as these Plane Striders. And still, no plane strider big. That's great. But I'm gonna kill these guys. Luckily, this is a kill quest, so I only need to kill three guy, three of these guys, and then I'm done. Unfortunately, they have pets, which make it a little bit harder, but not awful. Okay. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? Oh, he's a leather worker, maybe. Yeah, you're so cool. Walking around like that. Okay, let's go. And there's one over here. And then why is he following me around? Okay, one more hunter and then I'm done. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Why don't you just finish him off? <sighs> Jesus. Okay. Oh, great. I need to kill eight plunderers. So many things to kill. Please don't fuck. I'm gonna show him that I'm pissed off. Rawr. No. No. Bitch. Yeah, go kill that thing. You know what? These do so little damage, I'm not even going to kill it. There's no point. Well, I'm going to put it on, on it. I'm just going to run away from... Oh, so it, so it stuns you. I mean, dazes you. I guess there's a reason to kill him now. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Wait, what's it gonna run away to if it doesn't have a master? Oh. That's nice. Please don't steal my kill. Thank you.
I think I'm gonna finish these quests up, then I'm gonna leave off here. Uh, to this time, this is not a really great time to uh, be doing this questing because there's so many people out that are that keep on stealing my kills. Well, no, they're not my kills, but I'm just saying. And there's a little bit of ore over here. Or through, sorry. Grab that. And, uh. 99 XP for that. That's, that's pretty good. And there's one more over here. And that is ore. Please don't kill me. <laughs> Ow. So I actually think I'm just going to leave it off here and I'll finish these quests next video and hopefully get to level 12 and uh, then I'll get revive and star surge and kick some ass. So uh, I guess I will uh, see you guys next video which hopefully will be out either uh, today or tomorrow or the day after that. Somewhere in that time range definitely. So uh I'll see you guys later, and we might come out with another video today, we'll just, we'll have to see. Okay, have a good one.